it, it was a textile factory uh, built in 1882, uh, I believe. It was abandoned for 35 years before we took possession. The structure itself was in disarray. It used to be both the Union Pants factory as well as the Eagle Shirt factory, and hence when we were naming the building at the end, we called it the Union Eagle building to capture that history. Believe me, there's not a lot of uh, developers out there that would look at this building and have the vision that Mission First had. Mission First Housing Group is a nonprofit organization headquartered in Philadelphia, founded 30 years ago. We chose the Union Eagle Apartments as our first project in New Jersey because we saw an opportunity to create an affordable housing uh, development inside of a community and in, in context of the community and so be part of a community that we're trying to build here. We knew we wanted to accomplish two things in the design. We wanted to be able to produce a product that caters to the seniors that we're going to be using the property and bringing 48 apartments to, to the community. Um, so we needed to expand the existing structure, connect it, and build out of ground for, for the expansion. From the very moment we, went, we met with Mayor Lynch, um, we knew this was a, a project and a place that we wanted to be. One has to really give Mission First credit for, for following through this, this project. This, this is a historic building, and to, to be involved and have the courage to save the building and add on to it and, and really invest in Bordentown is what they did. They invested in us. They took a, a chance with us if their project would fit here. And it, and it not only fits very nicely, but we have two choices. You could have a dilapidated old historic building that, that was a fire trap basically at one time, or we could have what you see today. And uh, I've been through the building, I've been through the, the grounds and everything, and very, very impressive of what they've done.